What is the hot topic that everyone's buzzing about these days? CBD oil. We have an expert on the set tonight to tell you exactly what it is and how it works. Nicole Brewer, how are you gorgeous? So good to see you. So good to see you. I'm so excited that you could stop by and give us a, just some little me. 411 on this because I am like on the news, I see it all the time, CBD oil, um, all the different variations of it. I am so confused. So definitely CBD is blowing up. Right. Which, um, you know, so- What is CBD? So CBD is a compound that's naturally found in the industrial hemp plant. So when you ask how does CBD work, right. okay? So everybody has their bodies made up of an endocannabinoid system. So that system is what regulates your body. So if it comes from, you know, your immune system, your moods, your sleep, your inflammation, your pains, is managed by the endocannabinoid system. So what the CBD does is it binds with the receptors in the system that triggers the release to help bring your body back to the homeostasis. We all have different issues, pains, anxiety, depression. So we all need different different receptors to be triggered um, and you know again as I mentioned people are using it for such a wide variety of things I mean even up to people with seizures you know it's benefiting which is just it's incredible does it make you high is it like marijuana so no no nope it is not it does not make you high it doesn't give you the head high uh, the farm bill was passed in January of 2019 that it's legal to sell 0.3% or less of THC. However, some of the products that are out there carry 0% THC, but that even that 0.3%, it's so little, so little that you're not gonna feel that, that high, but it gives you all the benefits of that, of that hemp plant. So I'm gonna say um, I have torn meniscus. Okay. And I did the oil for the pain in my knee, and I could tell a huge difference after two weeks. Yes. Um, and also, a lot of people use it for inflammation. Mm -hmm. I know some people use it for uh, anxiety, Hunting. and a lot of people use it for sleep. But the question is, um, for our viewers out there, there are so many different variations of it. And then in each one, there might be 500, 1,000, right. 5,000. I'm confused on that. So my recommendation, I'm not a doctor, mm -hmm. so definitely consult your health, your, your physician I don't here. think a doctor will be prescribing this, but God, No, actually, you know do. what? They, a, a, there are, yeah. they don't prescribe it, however, and a larger doses of it. However, a lot of doctors, because of the opioid crisis, so many right. people are addicted to these pills. This is an alternative, mm -hmm. okay? That's helping people with the pain and you know different different problems. There's so many people with anxiety. I mean, you know, I work for my work for my dad. The anxiety right. that I have just working for my dad. And I'm a shout keep, out to Craig out there. Hi. He had he just some had, major surgery, yes. and we're so glad that he's, he's back in the yes, company. Yes, just shout out to Craig out there. Hi, Craig. <laughs> I used the tincture. Um, Again, it took about two to three weeks, and all of a sudden, I kind of felt this balance, right? Mm -hmm. um, if you have, I'm on the computer all day, and right. you know, a, 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 a salve or a lotion really helps with that like spot treatment of pain. So my recommendation is always to start lower and work your way up because you don't know what will work for you. Everybody's metabolism is different. Everybody's body like, receives things different. I mean, as you know, with any right. kind of food and stuff mm -hmm. like that. Uh, I mean, a 250 pound male or a 100 pound female, I would recommend a higher dose mm, exactly. for somebody that's you know bigger, but you don't have to go out and get a 1500 milligram CBD because you think that's better because right. all of, it, it's not, it's whatever works for your system. Right, and you, it's like anything. Like you said, medications work differently. Yeah, different some people, people you need a double dose. Sometimes right. you need Alcohol. more. Alcohol, I mean, all of it works differently. Yeah, some people, you know, two glasses of wine, you know, mm -hmm. and then other people, they can drink four and it doesn't four affect them. Right. So, yeah. yeah. I'm like, I don't know about not. bottles. But. So what is this? This is something new. And you, you, um, you said there's like a bar, like a. Yeah. Yes. So. Um, you mix and match the flavors. Yeah, or, so mm -hmm. actually, like a lot of the tinctures that you get are based. Tinctures. Tinctures, so, yeah. How's that different than CBD oil? So a tincture is a form. There's different forms of taking CBD, right? Mm -hmm. There's uh, a tincture. There are edibles. There are 
bath bombs, body lotions, salves. I mean, they have skincare out there. Mm -hmm. um, it's a wide variety of ways to take CBD. A tincture, I would say, is the most long Open lasting. Open tincture. <laughs> and so what flavor is this? So this is a mix of a lemon, uh, lemon, strawberry, citrus. Oh, yes. do, do you put it under your so tongue? So you put it under your tongue. You just keep it, it there for 30 to 60 seconds. But oh, you I can't can, talk. I well, you can just, it. yeah, it's, it's okay sometimes. You know, what's what's good about um, this, the, the flavors help take away that earthy taste mm -hmm. that, you know, a lot of people don't like. Um, but this is going to be more of your longer. Oh, it tastes so good. Yeah. I mean, it has a good flavor to it. Yeah, because in, in a lot of the products out there, they're going to be, you just have the citrus, you just have the mint, and you just have the natural. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty cool because you can mix and match to whatever you like. We all like different things. If you want an orange cream popsicle or you want strawberry mango with whipped cream mm -hmm. those are options that you know you can you can make over 5,000 flavor combinations so i love this so you can mix them at your own yes and to whatever strength you want yes so we have a the bartender will recommend yeah <laughs> right 100 this is kind of cool these are gummies right yes and these are flavored gummies these are flavored gummies mm -hmm. um so typically you know if you're talking to somebody you say take a tincture in morning and evening and then in between and how many, so this is based on your oh. weight so a tincture, you can, like you a said. A full you, dropper. Full dropper. Okay. Morning and evening. Morning and evening. Mm -hmm. And then this during the day, you know, if you feel that you need that little extra kick, your achy or your anxiety or mm -hmm. whatnot, we would recommend taking one in the middle of the day. Do they make you sleepy? Uh, it depends on the, on the person. There's different tinctures um, at, that are out there that even include melatonin or a kava root, you mm -hmm. know, which is known to help sleep. Um, if you take too much, me personally, you know, a stronger milligram, it does make me a little bit tired. Right, I'm glad I, you shared that. Right, yeah. if mm -hmm. I take the right amount, it doesn't make me tired because what it does is supposed to, it's supposed to bring Even you, you to, out the, yeah, to your, your level. Yeah, mm -hmm. homeostasis. They homeostasis, call it. Yes. I love it. Oh my God, I love you, Nicole. So I, this is like, I knew that you would be the person because this is something that is on everyone's minds and it is the hot topic and it is confusing because we don't understand it. Right, and so I recommend mm -hmm. for any of you viewers out there is making sure you pick a location or a shop that you ask for a certificate of analysis. You want to make sure, you know, there, there's CBD shops popping up everywhere. You want to make sure that you're actually going to somewhere that is, they're doing third party testing, they're interviewing the vendors out there, making sure the products don't have pesticides in it. And that you're asking for that when you go into the stores as well because you want to make sure that you're getting the purest form and checking the ingredients and making sure that they're the best products out so there. So check with the experts and it's, 100%. Uh, yes, exactly. And then there are so many other products, the lotions and the bath bombs. And it, so it, there's so many things out and there. And it all to try. depends on your preference mm -hmm. and your needs, you know, if again if you have aches and pains, arthritis, a lotion might work better than a tincture, you right. know? So it's just trying to, just try it with it. Right, 100%. Thank you so much yes, for stopping by. Thank you for having me. Gorgeous. Yes. Nicole Buer, Buer, Brewer, yes, making, um, making the cure for, you know, what ails you and explaining the 411. I was a little confused on it myself. Got so many emails from you guys out there. So I'm so excited we could bring an expert to the set tonight to explain it. So, hmm, one cure away.